to an arena survival action roguelike that also seemed to be blending in a little bit of tower defense elements here. You effectively create a giant conglomeration of turrets and move throughout a space environment in arena survival roguelike fashion. We got ourselves a big kind of tech tree for things to unlock for meta progress. Doesn't seem like you're necessarily buying power as much as you're just buying more options. So we'll see what we've got when we get in here. Roguelike mode. Alas. WA Steep. Does it? We don't, we don't need to aim to shoot. It does just happen automatically. E to build. I mean, am I dying here already? Okay, so we get three options. Cannon, Tesla Coil, Gatling Gun. I don't I don't know the difference really right now for actual gameplay. I'm assuming Tesla will do like a little bit of uh, linking. Cannon will probably do AoE. This will probably do standard. Standard. So these are, these are ones we're going to need to unlock. Scrapper Drone Hanger. Shorts. Give me another Gatling Gun. I'm curious how... Excuse me? That, I just run. Okay, fair, fair, fair enough. All right, noted. I'll just take a bunch of gallon guns, see what happens. So we got, so we can see what's going on there. Radar, all right. All right. All right. Okay, probably shouldn't have gone for this. Give me like a, we got a wall. Put it up there to block this side over here. Maybe, you know what? Maybe we do want a Tesla. Tesla cannon. All right. Just we want to position it so our walls are HQ Gatling gun. So either high quality or headquarters. <laughs> are you saying we upgraded our, our main headquarter Gatling gun? I don't know why. I just I feel like we should probably diversify, but alas... So are these all, these are the scraps that we need to get something. I don't know, I'm assuming kind of like our level up meter down here is from that typical arena survival fashion. And those little scrap drones are running out. God, I wish we had all this stuff, come on. Uh, they're running out to pick up that, all of the loot for me. So I don't have to walk over, which is good because we move slow as molasses, man. I saw there were stat changes and stat ups in the trailer. I, I hope to get them. I hope to get a movement speed up because Dang, you start so slow here. Here's the thing. It's like, it feels like maybe we should be pressing E to like craft every two seconds. But that pauses the game a hell of a lot. Uh, hello. Give me a wall down here. I don't know. Cannon Gatling. What are we missing? Do we have it? I think we don't have a Tesla anymore. Yeah, we do. It's right here. We've only got three options for turrets right now. It feels like, oh my God. Okay, uh, about the whole running aspect, let's go ahead and do that. These are starting to break down a little bit. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Oh my God. There's no way to actually dodge bullets. Like the bullets that are coming at you, they are coming at you and they will hit you. So it's about making sure you are building up appropriately to stop everything. But holy moly, this is obscene. Okay, I was waiting for that to break so we can get, put down another one here. I'm hoping that our little turrets are doing their job. Our little scrap boys are doing their job for us. Be careful so as not to run into that. The big thing is not chasing us that closely. Ooh, my God, we are really running out of... We're really running out of stuff. Maybe we are supposed to, like, <laughs> get meta progress before we do a lot better. I don't know, man. I will say, only having three turrets unlocked at a base, it feels like a little bit of a misstep. Feels like uh, a little too few to me. That being said, okay, I'm just going to keep on... I mean, I keep on building on exactly on cue as soon as we get the stuff to do it. Oh, my God. Back it up, 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 back it up. Shield, sure. Yes, please. Cover it up from that angle. You know what we want? I think we want the cannons. If we can get another. Ooh, one of those. Cannot stand that. <laughs> that Tesla sound effect is pretty bad, man. All right. Some more scrap pieces. I'm going to wait 
to build until we just get another turret. I, oh, those bombs do a lot. Those bombs do a lot. Those bombs do a lot. Uh, uh, moving is pain. We're out of the scrap drones, I think. No, no, they're, they're working. They're just going kind of slow. We're being approached mostly from this side. All right. Oh god, there's a lot that we're missing back there. But I have to I have to keep running for this bomb. Oh my god. All right. The radius is quite big. I feel like this is fine. But I think the cannon's good against these because the explosion does probably hit back behind. Oh my god. At this okay, at this point another one chases us. Is this one like actually a mini boss that we're supposed to kill? Things are getting wild. Oh! Okay, he's in. He's coming in for us. Oh my god, he's just ramming right into our face. Uh, I guess I'll pick this and put it here. It's going to inevitably die. I feel like we, we do not have the supplies to beat this sucker. God, the music just got so... So metal... Get, just get out of my face, man! This is not gonna go well. This is this is gonna be where we... Whoa! Okay, yeah, of course. Of course I died. D minus. Sure, just give me the lab. 15. 15 is all you get? 15 is all you get? That's... Uh... Oh, God. All right, we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to try one more run here. See if maybe we can get, like, a little bit more materials than that. Because no way in hell, man, is it only 15 per run. And everything costs that much. No way, man. No way did you do that. All right, let's see. I feel like we'll, we'll, we'll try and get a little bit more of a variety going on here this time. We got the Tesla, give me the, the Gatling, back it up. But yeah, your ability to actually run away from things, very, 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 very minimal. So, uh, really gotta make sure you're going. Give me the Tesla. Let's try and build like a little bit more clumped up towards the center. We're getting lucky with getting a lot of actual turrets. I would say that that is what you want it uh, see more see more uh pop down this so what are we missing uh just give me the alley. let's just try and build it out more like a, a logical little boring old square normal style yeah it seems to be really a lot more effective it's also also less cool. I like to build weird shapes and stuff like this, but it's just it seems like the meta is probably just make sure you've got yourself a uh... Okay, so it's an it's a high quality one. Make sure you got yourself a nice little square base. Easier to move around and dodge stuff that way. But I like the idea of putting the walls out and then we'll slowly be building out our base here. There we go. Uh, with something else like that. There we go. Whoop. Yeah, we, we're, we are killing things a lot faster. Go figure when we have more guns that are still alive. Who would have thought? I don't love that, but trying to see what side needs what. There's less guns over on the left because of these are scrap hangers. Get them, boys! Okay, we need a wall here. Give me a wall there. Alright. Big boy's about to show up. Okay, that guy's very far away. I'm not I'm not too worried about that. Give me just whatever. Just drop that up there. If we lose it, we lose it. Like obviously it'd be cool if it gets stuff. So are we supposed to take down these blue ones? Is that like do we get a big reward if we do that? 
Maybe there's like lots of scrap in here. Maybe, maybe. Okay, that gave me just a free gun. I mean, I wouldn't say, I guess I wouldn't say free, we did have to go find it. So the blue things, they're extra dangerous, but they do seem to be, okay, we gotta protect uh, those. Wallet up achievement. Okay, the big boy's not, he's not actually as close as I thought. Okay, this turret is taking lots of fire. We, how, how did we lose that one in there? Oh, because there's just a lot of shots that are just going in and there's nothing we can do about it. There's like some, they have Tesla coils as well. The Teslas, we just can't protect ourselves against them. They will, they will hit us and they will hit us where it hurts. Because they will automatically link into the center. But we got to be very, very careful about the big, big bombs. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. So far, so fine. Scrap collector. Should I? I feel like I'm just going to use a scrap collector more or less as uh, another wall. I think that's okay. Oh, when the bombs are coming from all angles, that's no good. Okay. Jeez. Yeah, you, you really just will start to slowly lose things. Oh, God. So this is one that we have to actually kill. Because it moves way too fast for us to have any other recourse. Yeah, like, I can't escape this one. Like, I literally can't... I I can't escape it. Look at that fire. I can't do anything about it. I can't run away further. I can't run away further. We broke one of the guns. Look at this. I'm, I'm running away as fast as I can, man. If I die from this, I'm going to be so mad. There we go. There we go. There we go. Hold. There we go. It can be done. It can be done. It can be done. Okay. All right. Let's pick up all this scrap. Holy moly, we have lots to defend here. Uh, that, sure, that, sure. Like, I want to put another turret in there. There we go. I was going to say, I want to put another turret in there before we block it off entirely. We need to stick around here for a while because there's lots of scrap for us to collect still. Yet. Oh, God, this is dangerous. Okay. Wall that's mostly coming from the top. That's something we can do. We can do that to make it so there's like a little gap in there. Ooh. Are we out of scrap collectors entirely? Okay. No, no, they're, they're there. They're just doing their job quite slowly at this moment in this juncture. Oh, God. Please. Please collect faster. Collect faster! I really wouldn't mind getting another scrap collector right about now. Okay. Another HQ gun there. So I think we have base... Oh, we're about to die. Our... I just can't, I can't collect this stuff. I don't have scrap collectors. I haven't been offered them. I don't know what to do about it then. Like... The fact that you lose your upgrades basically per- Yeah, well, th thanks. Thanks. You basically lose your upgrades permanently when you lose them. It's, it, imagine, like, if you took a hit in Vampire Survivors and you... So that's 37. That is not an okay amount. That's pretty slow. High quality cannon, HQ cannon. Here's the thing. Why would we do that though? Why would we want to replace our, our base over and over? So this is just literally get two Gatling guns. Or a Gatling gun that's twice as fast, twice as effective. 
It's the same video, so I think it literally does just mean you get two Gatling guns, which seems like that is quite literally, that is a power upgrade for sure. Duplicate a part. Uh, I don't care. Shield generator seems very important. Give me a shield generator. Yeah, I, I think you get I think you get materials right way too slow. But I want to see how this functions with a shield generator. That seems like kind of a very important thing to have. Replaced Gatling HQ turret. I mean, okay. Oops, I don't really want so many Gatlings. Cannon. <laughs> That's terrifying. That is terrifying. Okay. So when does the shield show up instead? Like, when do we get the option of that? Oh, right here, probably. Shield. Okay, instead of a wall, we could get a shield generator. Sure. I feel like I want to put a lot of my... Um, I'm assuming that'll just block bullets. I mean, just block bullets. You know what I mean. I think that'll block bullets. No, it's it's blocking those too. That seems fundamentally massive. <laughs> what a crazy power upgrade. Like, we're going to need more walls and everything, sure. Okay, break that, break that bad boy open. So yeah, we get a free extra thing there. Okay, get the scrap, sure. Just give me another shield bubble, sure. We'll, like, we'll just take all the shield bubbles for now. I don't know, I haven't seen one of our shields break yet. When that happens, I'm curious how that'll go down. But yeah, just getting that one unlock. It's one of those games. It's one of those. Gotcha. That's protected by two. Okay, so that shield is down for how long? I don't know. That's it? That is wild. That's so useful. We could have like a triple shield. Covering like almost the same area. Like, because I, I can put this here and it's defended by two. It's probably almost never going to be uh, in danger. Oops. We'll see. We'll see. I'm sure that there will be a catch at some point shortly. Like, move, 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 move. Move so it's just the shields. Okay. Just the shields are in danger. Yeah, it's a night and day difference, man. Okay. Hit me with another shield generator. Just put, put it right out there. Force field achievement. Thank you. <clears throat> it's way better than the walls. Are you kidding me? The wall sucks. The wall is so bad. But again, it's probably like the most base of units possible. Uh, you know. I'm going to use this to figure out, like, where, where do I want another bubble? I want another bubble up there. Be a big old moving bubble ball. Bu -bu -bu. The bubble ball. The bubble ball. I feel like this this one pickup, or this one change, is, is going to change everything, man. But we will see. But I feel like I haven't lost a single... Do these give scrap? They should. So we're going to put a bubble there. We'll do this. we can put another bubble there. I'm okay with that piece breaking if it needs to. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. But yeah, are we getting more stuff from that? It seems like we might be. Um, we're being approached from this side much more often. Okay, now, now we go up here. 
Uh-oh. Back it up, back it up, back it up. We're actually in danger now. For a brief moment, we have actual danger. <laughs> Sis, what do I even do? What do I even do? Do I put another one over there just to, like, double up on making sure we're fine in that spot? I think that's not a bad idea. Like, these are ridiculous. Okay. Finally. We, we want more guns. We just want more, more weaponry. And we want to make sure we are generally moving in, like, a, a circle direction around the boss when they show up. I think that's going to be more important than anything. Oh, God. Why does that sound so loud? Why? Why make that black? Like, I mean, I guess it's supposed to be scary, but... All right. As much as I... Oh. All right. Well, so much for that. So much for that. I can't... I'm, I'm trying, to, trying to move around. Okay. They've, like, overheated my, my stuff, I guess. Okay. Shields are down. Yeah, they have, like, some kind of EMP. They have, like, an EMP. They're, they're putting down my shields, you jerk. Okay, well, never mind. I didn't realize you were going to have an EMP. You got everything, don't you? You want to die there, mister? Oh, my God, this sucks. Everything was great until the man had an EMP. And now we're just hurting so bad. I, like, I don't think you recover from this, right? Like, I don't think you really recover from this. I mean, we at least have, like, a handful of scraps. Now... Okay. Get our shields back. Why is it? What is it saying? Like, why would we re like? Are we upgrading it when it says replace? Okay, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Okay. Now, go. That should help a lot. Oh. Okay. Just keep on building. Keep on building in the bubble. Building the bubble, baby. This ain't happening. I can't escape these. Kill me! Kill me! Kill me! Who has the EMPs? I hate them with my life. 37. Oh my god. I want to know what this is. It's shrapnel chip. Ah, uh, why do you not? This is see. This is this is what I hate about tech trees. This is one thing I hate about tech trees. This there should be at least one chip like this in the base game. You know, I I think in the base game there should be one like this. Like, do I want to spend points on just getting a double here? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna pop in for like a moment. See if we can unlock the thing that'll maybe make things. Make it so we can make some more interesting decisions. Like, I don't know how much we need to do to just get one. The I will say the bubbles... I put down a wall, didn't I? Yeah. Must have. The bubbles are great, but obviously, yeah, if they can just EMP them away like they're nothing, then obviously they're just as good as walls. Well, they're probably worse than walls in that event. So I guess... I guess you really do want to have both. That's the kind of thing you don't know until you see it, the EMP for the first time, though. Like, I didn't know that that was a thing in the game. And now we do. Now we know. All right, let's go break this thing. And then let's just force quit out and hope that we get at least one scrap. All right, kill me. Kill me. Kill me. Kill me. Oh my god. Zero. Because, like, I want to get that cool item to have, you know, like, I want to have fun. I want to do something wacky. 
All right. And it feels like the shrapnel is maybe a good way to potentially do something a little bit on the wackier side. Like, it lets me play around a little, little bit more with some weird stuff. We can... I'm imagining that everything that's connected to it does a little bit of shrapnel. I, I would imagine that's how it works. Everything that's literally adjacent to it gets that effect. I'd assume, I'd assume. Replaced HQ turret. Right now, that to me is reading like a wasted upgrade. Not that we get to choose, really. I could be wrong. If it if it's like a heal, then I guess that's not bad. If it replaces the station, maybe that's what it is. That that would make it a little bit better. If it's like you replace the gun and you also get to be uh, healed up, then it's then it's fine. Then it's an okay upgrade. Why not? All right, can we die yet? Can we die yet? Maybe we, if we just... I don't know, man. It just really feels like we do need upgrades in order to stand a chance because of how, how little you have control over whether or not you take damage. It all comes down to, like, are your... Do your towers do enough? But we don't really have options for towers yet, you know? Like, we don't really have options yet. We don't have those critical success ones where we get, like, two or three towers at a time. You know, that, that'll be quite a bit better. We would literally be twice as strong. So. I think that you're, you kind of know if you're going to be the person who will like something like this. Based off of how much you're willing to put up with grinding a game when there's not a lot of fun options. So that you can get to the point where there are fun options. I think you kind of know if that's going to be for you or not. I, I think I would imagine you would already know. Like, there's some people who see that and they're like, oh my god, I could get a lot of hours out of my $2.50 now. You know? Which, again, like, it's hard to be mad at the game. For, for $2.50, I yeah, guess, why not? Three bucks normally. But... I, I really do think some of these games need to that that have these really really hefty tech trees that make things just easier over time. Like I get it's probably just so that you feel like you really get the bang for your buck because like look how many hours it took me to get the maximum skill tree or something. But like it needs to get it needs to be fun to get to that point though. So like you need you need to have a good time up to that point. I feel like I could probably die now and get that unlocked, which will maybe spice things up a little bit more. Kill me! Yeah, the shields are amazing, but if there's literally an EMP, you die. Oh my god, like... Oh my god. I'm like, I like, can't die with the shields! But then the boss will show up, make him go away, and then I evap evaporate. I'm literally, I'm, I'm not doing anything. I want to die. This is almost looking like a good strategy at this point. Like, I know we have to run, but he's 123 miles away, meters away. Oh, okay. At a certain point, it forces us to pick. At a certain point, it's like, come on, dude. Pick an item. I'm curious. If this guy doesn't have an EMP, we might be fine. He does. Take me! Take me so that I can get a cool upgrade. Or I can let him go. If I if I kill him, that's fine too. Oh my god. Yeah, see, this is really telling. This is so telling. It's almost the same results whether or not I'm moving. It's almost the exact same results. I mean, like, obviously we are going to kick the bucket here, but... 
the difference is minimal. Kill me, please. Please, for Papa? Just a little murder for Papa. You guys suck, come on. Faster? Thank you. Thank you. All right, 15 scrap. Give me this, the chip. This is where I feel like the game might get actually kind of exciting, is linking up things like this. So this is the basic. This is with, yeah, like that's interesting. That's interesting. Exploding chip, piercing chip, chain chip, engineer drones hanger, Black hole gun. Sonic gun. Yeah, like, man, there's a, there's a lot of cool stuff. I just wish it was not tied behind probably like 20, 20 hours, you know? 20 hours to, to get like something that's not just super basic. I'd say definitely start with the shield. Give me the... Okay, let's, but now, but here's the thing. Now we have to actually think about how we um, will use the flak. I think we start with this, and we make it in a plus formation around there, and then we just assume that that'll be... And, like, uh, I'm going to start super protecting that one spot right there. See, there we go. We got the chip already. Oh, it affects everything in a... Okay, I thought that it would just be everything... Well, hmm. Slightly suboptimal, then. Okay, I'm, I'm wondering if it impacts the cannon. It, it sure seems like it does. Tesla? I can't tell if it's impacting the Tesla or not. The Tesla. Just put it all right around there and defend the hell out of it. It's definitely impacting the cannon and the gatling. That... Or... Well, it's definitely, definitely impacting the gatling. It sure looks like it has something to do with the cannon, like it's doing something, something, something. Not positive, though. I think uh, it might be a good idea to do a little bit of protection on this side over here. All right, so everything is all used up there. Maybe we, um... Maybe we start, like the same sort of idea over here in kind of like a, a peanut shape see just the, yeah the addition of this one chip actually spices things up a lot it's it's such a tiny tiny thing but it, it changes how I have to build greatly Like, I, I, it's, I can't just do it willy-nilly anymore. Like, I probably can. But... Now there's actually a little bit more heft to it. Alright, and I'm just gonna keep building and assuming here that I will get another chip at some point and I'll put it right in the middle there. And we'll build out accordingly. Another shield would be fantastic. Um... If I build here, it'll be sub... See, this is the thing. If I build here, it'll be suboptimal for the chip, but it would be the best coverage. I guess I'll just do it right here for now. Oh, move, 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 move. We're getting wrecked by these. Oh, God. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Move my good side. Danger, danger. 
There we go. There we go. Now we got the flak over there at the good side going. Alright. And this is kind of just like the scrap section. Yeah, we lost a good chunk down there. But look look at that. It's just the the flak's doing work. Did we lose anything in here? We did not. If I put something here, surely it'll be gone. Maybe we just eat the loss of one turret, one thing not being connected. Okay. That's gonna, yeah, that takes damage out there. Oh no, shields down, shields down, shields down. Ooh, move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Danger, 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 danger. Shield back up, shields back up, shields online. Okay. There we go. Now we're protecting our other clump down here. Okay. Alright. We're about to get the big boy blast showing up. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Oh! Alright, where's he gonna... S that was terrible. That was gut-wrenching. Oh, but I can't do anything about it. Alright, shrapnel chip at this point. Sure. There we go. That I mean, that should help a lot, for what it's worth, but... Ow! Basically, is what I'm getting at. Alright. Here comes the pain. We lost our shield. Does it really matter, though? We're probably gonna just lose it again. Whatever. Maybe we maybe we put down a wall at that point. I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay, there's the big ship over there. Just wanna kind of wanna. Oh my god! You son of a gun, man! Come on. The flak better do... The flak should be doing so much more work here. There we go. There we go. Because he has so many parts clumped up together. It should be fantastic. Yeah, that looks like it does heal. Okay. Huge. Okay. We lost such a big section over there. But we're, we're a lot better off than we were. Or than we ever have been after. I mean, not that he's in bed yet, but he's about to be. Okay. Okay, that part's about to go. Well, that's not good. Oh, God. So this does not look like it does. It doesn't look like it can hype up this. Maybe it's worth trying just to see. Try a wall. Okay. All right. All right. Turret. Good. 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 Oh my god. No good. No good. No good. I hate. They hate the flame boys. I hate the flame boys. Come on. Bag it up. Bag it up. Bag it up. Bag it up. Chip there. Did we lose our... We lost our shield over on the left. That's not good. Alright, so we have to be on the left side of him now. We have... Sc oh! That hurt. Scraps for days. Not good. I need a shield so bad on the left side. I think maybe we need to let them ah, eat our scraps. No, no, that's it. That'll do her. That'll do her. Right, 
rip. Slowly, slowly disintegrated, eaten off into the dust of the universe. 37. Yeah, just like <laughs> flamethrower. That sounds fun. Like double, like the fact that we can get double flamethrowers, like all these extra rarity ones, those, they take up the extra slots. Yeah, you know, getting that, for example, would be a big deal to the point where it's like, sure, like research that, we get the double. Uh, research, you know, double, give me the double rocket. No, we can't. Oh, we have to get that HQ cannon. Why? why uh, th that's the one upgrade that I'm most confused by. Is it? Is it upgrading it or not? Because otherwise, it just seems eh. It seems meh. 25 to get that garbage. I don't want. I don't really want that garbage. Can we get the shield doubler? HQ shield generator. Now that seems like that would maybe be worth swapping into. That would be maybe worth swapping into. Duplicate part. Kind of just feels like... Uh, it actually could be kind of nice. It could be kind of nice. Because you'll get exactly what you need at the moment. Fuel tank. Just lets you move faster. Let's you move faster. Sure. All right. Let's just let's let's briefly see what it's about with that stuff. But yeah, just I think no going in. If you want to have like a good time with the game, you're gonna probably need to play for a while before it gets really like more spicy and you actually get to make some interesting choices. See, like look at this. That literally just is twice as strong. <laughs> That's just twice as strong as the other upgrade. And we just, we got it now because it, it, I thought that it was just unlocking options, but it's definitely not. It's definitely 100% upgrading power. I guess we need to look at those other ones now. I, I assume that every like drone part is, you know, just going to give us drone options, but maybe, maybe not. Like I know it's a, it's a rare drop to get the times two. Chip. Yeah, I, I can't quite tell if the cannon is working for the shrapnel or not. I think it I think it is. I really don't know though. Don't know at all. What is this thing? Fuel tank. Left shift to boost. Oh my god, that's... Uh, why? Like, all the all the fun stuff is, is just... Really locked behind stuff. Like, now we have the actual ability to, to maneuver. We can actually dodge things now. Like, that's the thing. There's some fun things here. There are some really fun things here. And if you're willing to, to put in the work with the meta progress tree, like... Seems like you're gonna get a, get a good amount of stuff. Is this boosting us faster? Because it's using up the fuel out of both. Oh my god. See, like, look at that. Getting all these times two Gatlings now? We're getting Gat we're getting weapons literally twice as fast now. That being said, I don't love that we keep getting fuel. I'm not sure how it works. Because they are all getting drained at the same time. Maybe it's just like the more of them, the more capacity we have. Like they're all being used at the same time, but it's like we have a higher max capacity. That could be the case. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's not that this is, this is not bad. Like this is, there's, there's fun to be had here. I just wish that there wasn't so, uh, so little at the beginning. Like, there can be just as much to unlock over the course of time. It can take 12 years if you, if you really wanted to. It can take 50 hours to unlock the full, the full fun tree of the game. If, if that's what you want to do, go ahead. 
But I feel like there should be a little bit more at the start. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Attack the shields a little bit. Oop. Who's done that? But yeah, like having just having a little bit of boost goes a long way. It means we can actually kind of dodge some stuff. We can actually maneuver fast enough to get out of some danger. Like we can dodge mines. See, like look at that. We can dodge the mines actually. But again, we need more unlocks so that we're not just getting fuel tanks every time we we get the gear option to show up. Because. Since we only have that one option, but we don't need a million of them, we're just not getting very many guns anymore. Like, we got the double guns, and yet still. Like, I could probably... I could probably outrun some sons of guns. There we go. There's the double. Probably shouldn't put those. I think those are probably outside the uh, the radii. Hello. I think we're gonna get bopped. Truthfully, I, I think that we're actually <laughs> we're actually weaker. I mean, we can outrun the uh, the fire now if that's your deal. If that's who you are. Back it up. See, look at that. We actually have- we can actually stand a chance at getting out of the radius of the fire now. Okay. I mean, we're probably gonna die anyways, but... But it's at least- it's fun to know that we can move. But yeah, see, the thing is, we got so many, uh, fuel things. We didn't get as many gun options. We need to have more unlocks so that when we get that that option, we're not always taking the same thing. Okay. But I do like that. Look at we can outrun him now. Oops, I, I beefed I beefed it, but we can. You can do it. It is something you can do. Oh, I'm out of fuel now. I know what I'm doing, just, I know that this is dangerous, I'm just, I've, I've got faith in the doubles. Oh, that's so worth it, though. That's so good! Ah, it's ridiculous. We got the two and it just fixed everything. So quickly there. Yeah, also getting like a double fuel tank sounds great. Crap. Sure. There's another chip. For somewhere. For somewhere. I don't really have a good spot for it. Ugh. There we go. Th double Gatling. Now we have double Gatling with piercing just right off the bat there. Fantastic. 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 Good. Get out. Get out of the fire. Get out of the bombs. Oh, get out of the fire. Get out of the bombs. Get out of the fire. Get out of the bombs. Yeah, like the fuel tanks make things a lot more fun for sure, too. Like every upgrade I get is making the game noticeably more fun. But like, here, let's just run into the middle. I'm, I'm, I'm ready to... I'm ready to be taken away, but at the same time, like, look at that. We, we can also just... Here, take me away. Take me away. Boop, 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 boop. It's just... It, I'll be real. At base, zero upgrades. At zero upgrades in the meta tree, the game's not very fun. <laughs> like, I, it's actually not very fun. Uh, but... I can definitely see the trajectory of the game potentially becoming quite fun when you have like all of these that you're trying to modify and put in and everything like that. 
into the gameplay, like trying to figure out what layout is going to be optimal, like slapping that in with flamethrowers, trying to figure out like, oh, does, well, obviously, does, does chain work with flamethrower? Does mammoth clip chip whatever you know does that work with it does railcon like like all these cool items cool upgrades cool ideas emp that stuns him in place like that seems huge railgun just seems like a fun thing you know like there there seems like there's lots of cool things but you will just have to play for a while before you can have the amount of fun that uh that it looks like you can have but if you're fine with, with sitting through that grind, it seems like this might be a fun game for you. Uh, and especially at the price of three bucks, there's really not much to complain about. Like there's a lot of three, like it, it's, that's going to lose its value at some point because we are getting a lot of really incredible games for $3 ever since like Vampire Survivors shows that, you know, having a nice tight game, tight replayable game for three bucks is like a very profitable thing to, to be. Uh, I think there's going to be a lot more games like that. And there will be a point where you're like, well, should this be the one that I spend my three bucks on? And and that's the thing is like, I don't know, man. That, that's up to you based off of what you saw here. If this looks like up your alley, I think it could potentially get really fun when you get all the max upgrades. But boy, boy, it is not fun when you are at zero. Like it's actively unfun at zero. A couple upgrades and I'm like, all right, I'm having, I'm starting to have a little bit more fun with this. I'm starting to figure out, you know, interesting tactical decisions to make with planning out my ship but until that point it's just kind of slow it's like slow sluggish there's no real decision making in your weapons there's no real decision making at, at all in until that point but alas uh again probably incredibly fun at max lap probably incredibly fun but i think that you know you gotta get to that point i don't know how long it'll take it seems like it'll take a long long time thank you for watching though this has been Run Build Pew. You can pick it up right now. Link on Steam. There's a free demo if you want to try it out for yourself. See what you think. Uh, full game is only three bucks on sale for 10% uh, off for the for a week here. So there you go. Link in the top description. My name is Retromation. Cover any games every single day with an extra specialty in roguelikes and roguelites. If that is something you are interested in, this is a channel that you should be subscribed to. Thank you. Thank you. And I will see you next time. Bye.